Hey my TTs, welcome back. So it looks like the artist who created the popular song, She's a Runner, She's a Track Star, Girl, Mooski has finally dropped the music video for the song yesterday. Now, while a lot of people loved the music video, a lot of other people were very disappointed. And I'm going to tell you guys why they were disappointed in the video. In my opinion, I thought it was a great video, but this is why fans were disappointed in his video there was a challenge that came out after that song started to blow and the up. reason why i say afterwards is because during muski's the breakfast club interview when he was talking about how the song blew up he said nothing about the tiktok challenge actually charlemagne is the one who brought it up and he said that everything that happened after track star happened organically after the song so that's why i'm saying afterwards but any Anyways, the track star challenge came from City Boy J. He's the one who came out with this popular dance, and people were so disappointed to see that he was not in the music video that dropped yesterday. So they were upset, tagging City Boy J, letting him know that he should have been in the music video. And they were on Mooski's page, you know, mad at him, asking him why City Boy J wasn't in this music video when he basically made your song blow up. Well, City Boy J did respond to all of the fans that were mad and upset for him. And he posted and said, nope, I'm not in the video just because someone don't want to work with me because of who I it am. It will not stop me from what made me who I am today and all I have done for Mooski, even if he don't recognize what I did. God and all of my supporters is what keeps me going. People might say what I did. Just know I changed that man's life. And I'm still working from the bottom with no support. Like I supported this song. My surprise is at 7 p.m. And he was basically letting everybody know at the end of that that he had a surprise, you know, and he was collaborating with Johnny Blaze. But that's what he had to say towards the situation. He's basically saying he made the song what it was and that he changed Mooski's life when he came out with that challenge for the song. He's also saying that some Someone did not want him to be in the video because of who he is now he didn't say if it was Mooski himself or he didn't say if it was his manager or just somebody from his team but he said someone didn't want him to be in the video because of who he was and those are some very strong allegations now let's get into both uh, sides of the situation because you guys know I love to get into both sides I can see where you know one person is wrong and the other person is right and what the other person is wrong and the other person is right so let's start this off city with boy jay so like i said i did like the music video i felt like it was pretty interesting it kind of gave me that whole rihanna vibe in the beginning of the video but do i feel like city boy jay should have been in the music video yes of course i feel like he should have been in the music video especially because he said that he asked one of the team members or that he's in insinuating because he didn't actually say in his post that he asked he's kind of insinuating that he asked Mooski or one of his team members could he be in the music video and somebody refused him because of who he is and in the music video I feel like he should have been along with the dancers now I was a little confused because some fans felt like he should have been one of the dancers while other fans felt like he should have been the love interest instead of Coyle Ray, but that's neither here or there. I just feel like he should have been in the music video. Now, for him saying that he feels like he made Mooski who he is or the song what it is, I kind of feel like that's a little offensive, but if it's the truth, it is the truth. Now, we're talking about both sides here, so let's get into Mooski and his team's side of the situation. Now, you know, people should have first noticed the problem about him not really giving you know city boy jay the credit that he feels like he deserves in the breakfast club interview that was posted a week ago because in the interview he did not mention anything about the tiktok it actually took charlemagne to bring up the tiktok for him to even say anything about the tiktok and even with that he didn't say that the tiktok
TikTok made the, his song what it is. But is any artist going to say that somebody else made this dance and that's why my song blew up? No, they're probably not. And the way that him and his team is probably looking at the situation, they're probably just like, well, we posted him because Mooski did post City Boy J in the challenge to his Instagram why do we need to take it further and allow him to be in the music video which is definitely wrong because if they know that he made the song bigger than what it was before they definitely should have included him in the music video and if they're not including him because of who he is that's even more wrong it's just really ridiculous but I'm hoping that Muski responds to this situation because I know he's seen these post going around i know he sees his fans you know or some of city boy j's fans upset about this situation so far he has not said anything i can only imagine maybe he's trying to enjoy the releasing of his music video but maybe he'll address this situation later but it's something that definitely needs to be addressed it doesn't need to be left alone because he's going to have a lot of people upset if he doesn't say anything about this or somebody from his team doesn't mention anything about this or clear it up but you guys let me know what you feel about this situation in the comments below anyways let's move on into miss jt little uzi and young miami sister so it looks like the whole situation that happened between little uzi vert and young miami last week on instagram live caused a lot of drama you guys know what i'm talking about if you don't make sure you check out the video in my description that will explain the whole situation Southside basically came to Young Miami's defense and now it looks like Young Miami's sister is coming to her defense as well. She basically outed Little Uzi Vert guys and posted some pictures of Little Uzi Vert trying to slide in her DMs and she was alleging that this happened while JT and Little Uzi Vert were together so he was doing this behind JT's back. This is what Young Miami's sister is a legend. Now, the pictures show little Uzi Vert sliding in her DM, sending her a heart emoji, then asking her what's up. And then it shows that she did not respond. Then Young Miami's sister posted to her Insta story and said, Never play on my sister's top. I love her just like Jai did. And Jai is Young Miami's baby father who passed. Then JT decided to respond and she said, How do it feel really to have that much blank in your heart? You make up lies stuff is not adding up photoshopping was horrible forget the avi leave him alone before me he was just a random weirdo in your world now i'm starting to see who the weirdos are and then young miami's sister decided to respond to her and she said jatavia jatavia forget you i left you on red all day and didn't answer your call next then jt was like blank raised you i'm done and after that you know the whole argument was over but obviously there's some beef going on with jt young miami and her family and everybody because of little uzi vert and young miami going live last week and people feeling like little uzi vert was just disrespectful to jt's best friend young miami and just like i said after this whole argument nothing else was said young miami didn't even respond to this situation she might later but so far she hasn't said anything towards this situation now little uzi vert and jt let it be known today on instagram that they are good they are on good terms and nothing has changed in their relationship little uzi vert recently bought her another birkin and as you guys can tell from the messages of her arguing with young miami sister she doesn't believe what you know young miami Miami's sister posted that little Uzi Vert actually slid in her DMs. But y'all let me know. Do you think that little Uzi Vert actually slid in young Miami sister DMs? Or do you feel like JT and that she just photoshopped that picture? You guys let me know in the comments below. Once again, my lovely TTs, thank you for watching Tease Room. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel and turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time I upload. And I will see you my lovely TTs in the next video.